Hey guys, welcome to this new video. So if you join in this video, that means you need some editing skills that I only have and uh, uh, yes, you don't have. So keep it going, uh, watch this video and remember to subscribe and leave a like. Let's go to Vegas guys. Here we are guys, this is my last video if you want to see this, this is the, how, how I do the videos, yes it's this. So the first thing I want to do is to add the transitions, okay? There are two ways, the first is to where you find the best part to put the transition, cut with the key cut and then you hold your clip and drag it to the other, like this. I usually put like uh, 17 or 20 frames, I don't know what you guys want. Then you guys have to go to transitions, make sure you guys have some transition pack in your packages here. So I choose a random like this, I drag and put on the clip. Now you can edit your clip uh, as you want, like this, 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 doesn't matter what you want, you want to put, then close and you're done. The second way to add the transition guys is to do the same thing as before, so cut here, but this time we have to go back 10 keyframes, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, cut, and do the same thing as the other way. Then when you cut these two clips, then open your uh, effects here, and as you can see, there are some effects like these and these with the A and B. The, the part A you have to put on the on the first part, and the part B you have to put here on the last line. So click on, for example, this slide left A, add, OK. And once you're here, you have to drag these balls here at the hand, and this in the middle, and the middle of all. When you're done on the first part, you have to do the same thing on the last. And boom, you're done. Okay guys, first of all, I want to say this effect, you can do it with uh, all ticks you want. So in this case, I did it with uh, the stick here because it wasn't moving, so the effect is very good. First thing guys, is to find the part where you want to do this effect, I choose this part. And copy it. Then under the clip, like here on, the, on this line, select uh, paste and drag it here, down. Now we have to work on this part here. The first thing to do on the clip here is to open the punk crop here, select the mask and enable it. Then you have, you have to zoom like here and move if you can, but I'm, I can, oh my god, please, please. Okay, you find your the sticker. Select this uh, pen like this. And you guys have to select the the stick like like this. And then click on the first marker to close the mask, like this. Yes guys, you're, you're done. The second thing now to do for see the blowing stick here is to search the effect unietto. This effect, yes. You have to drag it on the first clip, this. Now, as you can see, you see your effect and normally I put the glow intensity like uh, at uh, 68 because uh, if you put like this you see is not cool okay 
and here you can change the color or what you want guys doesn't matter the, the colors you can do it like these these doesn't matter guys now you guys are gonna ask uh, what uh, this clip under the first can do it well I let you see guys if you delete this clip you see this so you have to put a clip uh, now you have to put a clip here and uh, now we're done if you want to put uh, this outfit also in bed uh, doesn't matter you can do it with uh, whatever you want guys now i did it with the stick but you can do it also with the guy there it doesn't matter Okay guys, this is the part where we can do this effect. So my opinion is to open the punk rock here and go like uh, at this point guys, uh, this, uh, and you have to reduce your screen like this, it doesn't matter, you guys have to choose. I put like this, mm, yeah this is cool, then you see this little point, uh, you have to copy it and uh, paste it like here at the same at the same distance from this and this and at the end like this you click uh, right button and restore okay guys so guys then you will see this then guys we have to search the wave effect here on the the video effects take it i use uh, my which is this drag it on the clip and uh, click on, on this button here animate and now you see we already have this little point because we have the, the setting here drag this line at the end and you mm, just have to change this this point here from this to this at zero yes guys now your clip will look like this which is waving and uh, now we have to put a background here because uh, the black background is very sad you can normally just put uh, a solid color probably white uh, you see this and also you guys if you want to put this background here you just have to copy the clip paste it here and remove the wave effect here and also these points here we have to delete it so delete this delete this and also this and now as you can see we have the same screen behind okay some people also for do this better add uh, the focus so search the focus which is this use the default yes guys add it and this is the clip it will look like and also guys uh, some people ask me if you want to put the line here you just have to search the same effect as before uniecto edit and you will see this guys okay now i take this for example when you guys have done this you probably see your clip uh, okay you're done but when we go on the next clip uh, we need a shake because uh, for do this better this effect better so there are a few shake i use the first is the fisher shift here i add the fisher shift too as you can see we will see this which is pretty cool and i also recently used the warp bubble shake and uh, you can edit uh, here the race color which is this uh, for editing uh, your race just change the color here yes guys now i will put uh, some clips some different uh, clips of the wave so hope you guys enjoyed this video this is my first commentary video my editing commentary video if you want to see this is my editing of the editing so remember to leave a like and subscribe and see ya